hello everybody welcome to week two of super league group b we've got olivia dulac versus artemis black here olivia has won the toss and decided to kick which makes sense because i think the only thing that skaven have is the one turn <laughs> so i guess i would always kick with what else uh, with what else with skaven also it's in the rain right which helps him um art has got the uh package right the extra skill package so we've got three guard, a tackle, a block and two wrestle. I think that's pretty standard. Pretty standard. And uh, also Olivia is somewhat standard. So this is Olivia's gone a guard and a mighty blow. Core went two guards. I must say I prefer the two guards. The sidestep makes the one turn brilliant. Juggernaut makes the one turn brilliant. Juggernaut and sidestep together makes it basically unstoppable. Leader's nice, isn't it? Because you can't get extra arms. A wrestler, a block, and a strip, so he's got like all the cool. T the toolkit. Though actually, after playing the game with Skaven, I actually did quite like Soul's wrestle strip because without both, you feel a little bit bad up hitting the ball and stuff. <laughs> yeah, Kvog, obviously, Kvog using two guards would be cheating, so yeah. <laughs> he decided to only use one. <laughs> Make things fair. Swart is getting to hit a good run with Tackle here, straight off the bat. Um, he'll be very happy about that, I'm sure. Setting up in this 3-3 formation so that he's protected more against the Blitz. Rather than, you know, like he could have just, you know... If he'd put this zombie here, the flanks would be too exposed to a Blitz. So that's why he started wider, so he can move them in. To get the hit, moving them in isn't too much of a cost. Have to move your bludger under there. Hope for a touchback, doesn't get it. Diced. <laughs> it's the push. You can almost hear him complaining. <laughs> Just pushes him away. Of course, he could have. He could have uh, followed and then three dice with the mummy. And then just two dice this guy at the end. Move these guys over. Probably should have moved this guy over already. Art with the weak. The weak, the uncharacteristically weak turn ordering there. Because surely he's not going to make GFIs. Gets a removal. Instant. The problem here is, of course, he's going to probably... Okay, so I was going to say he's going to probably use him to assist that, which exposes him, but he doesn't assist that and doesn't expose him. Interesting. I'm assuming one. So he really wants to get the knockdown here to not leave this guy in contact. Whatever he does is going to have some risk attached, so... This guy runs across. I always say that Art has the best uh, autopilot, and I think he does, but you'll still see things like that, that ghoul not moving across first thing. Good knockdown, helps a lot. Just a push. Now you go for the pickup before the last block, right? The last block, you don't want to waste a reroll on. Well, I didn't mind. I would have also maybe moved this ghoul one up first. And then, like, you know, move. If you move to here, I don't think it matters too much which square he's in, but it would have maybe he's afforded a little bit more protection. To the pickup. One guy at the OS and one across. Because the ball was here, right? So he just wanted it away. He just wanted to make sure there was like more reinforcement away. He was gonna always have to follow. Because he couldn't leave like this one he's not followed, right? And left him free to move. He couldn't leave this guy free to move over this side. So he thought to put him there, so at least he's on two players if it's a push. Banter. Hello, Chi. Chi, good. Chi. 
Chicken. Wait, is Seabro did Seabro's win a, din a wooden spoon at the Danish Open? Or is this somebody else? Also, what's Seabro's using at Euroball? It's not you. Oh, Seabros is uh, using the, those Dark Elves, right? Assassin. Assassin Delves. Yeah. The Super League winning Dark Elves. That's very impressive, isn't it? More impressive, some might say, than winning Euro Bowl. <laughs> it kind of, kind of in a way, right? The density of of games is is higher. Like the density of competition is higher. Really. There's a, I mean, there's a lot of luck. Like obviously, everyone wins Euro Bowl is good, but um, there's a lot of luck, isn't there? Even with even with teams of eight, there's still a lot of luck. Like you know, for example, you could not have to face. Uh, the second best team, like if you were the, if you were the best team or if you were the second best team. Um, no, no, everyone who wins, everyone who wins sea balls, everyone, everyone who wins you. <laughs> but like you know, the first round, like there's still a lot of luck, right? You could just get, like let let's say you're the third best team at Euro Ball, right? Got no idea how anything would be rated, but let's say you're the third best team at Euro Ball. You could just get the best team in the first round, or the best team could get the second best team and just pick up a loss. You know, one of them picks up a loss straight away, and all that kind of stuff. So there's still lots of uh, there's still lots of luck, just purely in like matchups, and then like in team matchups. Then there's luck in the mat in the race racial matchups, right? Couldn't there be like you know your your dark elves could get well nothing dark elves don't really have a bad matchup, but like. Uh, I don't know, right? Amazons could get dwarves, right? Things like that. Um, so there's like, there's all things like that that can happen. <laughs> no AV break. And yeah, he's basing people up to try and generate hits for future turns. The tackle here, this is an unfortunate position because the tackle is exposed, but you still want to keep him there to stop the mummy easily getting hit. So yeah, he's probably going to dodge this guy off to try and protect the mummy and then move him later if he got the chance. But now, this guy could get picked off by the roger. Seems pretty nice. <laughs> 69 percent of it. Yeah, dark elves don't really have bad racial matchups, do they? Like they probably had a bad one versus underworld when underworld were overpowered. But apart from that, they're pretty, they're pretty solid, aren't they, Delves? Pretty solid. And without a package as well. It's interesting because you want to go for, like, for the long term, you want to go for the tackler here. For the drive, I just don't know what you do here. You just stand in the way a bit. Like, it's hard, isn't it? It's just hard to do anything as that. Oh, and you've got the assassin for the underworld, didn't you? <laughs> Chaos his own player, well done. Rat Ogre, most reliable big guy in the game at removing your own guard players. Oh yeah, I know that now, Chicken, but like in the old days, in the old days, when they had 14 players and would just knock down a dark elf and foul them to death, like the 11 man roster is a bit bit susceptible to that, isn't it? Just getting steamrolled. But yeah, not now. Now not a problem at all.
It's wrestled. Rerolls. That doesn't want to be wrestled. Because it gets him guarding, doesn't it? This is still not easy to escape. Like, you know, you have this nice little fancy cage to that, but it's all, you know, Olivier's based everybody. Based the, you know, based the mummies. So they're, they're out of this. And it looks like this is going to be a 1D to hit the, uh, hit the roger. He kind of did need pushes there, probably, didn't he? It's a 1D with block. I mean, it's a 2+. plus. It's a 2+, plus to get the roger off. That's fine, isn't it? And then just move. I would say it killed them, kill. I've played one game with them against humans. Oh my god. Out of rerolls now, Art, on turn three. But, you know, it was it was that, or it was a 75% dodge. And a 75% dodge is way too fucking dodgy, isn't it? So he had to do the 1D there. He had to do the 1D. He had to. After playing one game with, with, with the new Underworld versus humans, so to be fair, humans could be a horrible matchup, um, it felt awful. Just awful. Just awful. It was, it was ludicrous how bad it felt. Oh, it does have to dodge away this uh, ghoul, doesn't he? Doesn't need to do these blocks. I mean, of course he's getting a removal. Just makes the cross kid. Because he's got guards. A blockless block. I couldn't even foul anything, like, well, neither me nor Sol could foul everything, but again, it was against humans, so, so maybe a tough matchup. This is a very nice, uh, very nice zombie position, wasn't it, so that both of them, if they powled it, this guy would be marking both of them, freeing up both of his mummies, and, uh, two, making a two-for-one trade, so that was a very good, very good zombie position. And now Olivier's got three re-rolls, and Art's got none. So, uh... We're going to see Olivier do everything he can to try and get the roller on the ball, right? Because then Art's got a roll dice. And you're probably basing everything up every turn. <laughs> uh, what? He didn't use Juggernaut? <laughs> what? <laughs> yes, I mean, I worked out... It misclick or bug, right? It's not necessarily a misclick. It could be a bug. It could be a bug. But, um... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wonder if he's messaged out saying it's a bug, it's a bug I don't know if he's messaging him or not could be messaging him on Discord, couldn't he? yeah those things are annoying, aren't they? Because they're not a Blood Bowl mistake. They are a Blood Bowl 3 mistake. You've got to play the game, haven't you? You know? Like, that's the thing, isn't it? Like, you know... It's definitely part of the game. To press the right buttons. <laughs> There's no getting away from that. Like pressing the buttons is pretty much all most games are, in fact, isn't it? <laughs> Lovely hit there on the stripper. Yeah, 
Yeah. I mean, like, on, on most video games, press, pressing the right buttons is is nearly all of the game. I, I guess most games have some element of tactics or strategy. But, um, mostly. Mostly it's pressing the right buttons, isn't it? But it always feels bad in Blood Bowl when you're making the right tactical decisions to lose from pressing the wrong buttons. Ah, yes, kill. Yeah, that was super annoying. Yep. Yep. Yeah, that that's fair. Putting it out like that, it's it's completely fair. It, it's it's a bad mistake to make in Blood Bowl three, the video game. It certainly is. But it's always going to be frustrating to like you know table toppers because it's not a. Uh... <laughs> yeah, that's a good point as well, BB Joe. <laughs> But like you know, it's because it like table toppers. They know they'd never do that in real life, would they? Right? So like it's frustrating because so many so many people play the game. Uh oh, is Olivia just quitting or not? Or maybe oh, do you know what? Maybe he got one of the bugs where you know like it looks like all black and white and stuff. So maybe he's all F4ing to get rid of that. I remember somebody had that for like a whole game and they just couldn't tell who was who for the entire game. Oh, it's broken on art side. <laughs> yeah, it's not against Seabros, yeah. Yeah, plenty of bugs. So it could have been a bug that caused that from Olivia. It could have just been a misclick. Oh well, he got he got a dead white out of it. <laughs> he got a dead white out of that misclick, so you know, not terrible. <laughs> now there's no tackle to hit all of his gutters for the rest of the match. Yeah, no regen. Gets this guy around. Oh. No, he's just everyone's basing. I thought he might have like taken his foot off the throttle and just get him back, but no, it's maximum basing, let's go. Is he gonna I don't know screen him? Is this guy gonna screen? Olivier really is balls to the wall <laughs> all the time, isn't it? Ah, uh, that's players, wouldn't it? Yeah. Well, at least it was. At least that was Art's problem and not Olivier's from like the misclip, right? It would have been. It would have been horrible if the you know if Olivier's had frozen and led to that. But you know, if it's if it's just error, then it's not so bad, is it? He did, I mean, he made a bunch of three pluses, didn't he? He made a bunch of three pluses. Bit of three dice, and then I guess dodge the gal. Problem is though, dodging these two, even if you make them, it invites all the pressure, doesn't it? <laughs> Can't get a knockdown. Back to him, back to pals. <laughs> yeah, maybe just like keeping him like here or something to like ward off mass spacing might be an idea. Oh, huge dodge. I 
That's quite nice, isn't it? Defense from the Rogue. Could put two players on and, and GFI 3D Blitz with the Rogue. Just to get him hit by Mummy. That seems rubbish, doesn't it? It's the Garda. <laughs> oh, man. He's already killed the Garda once. <laughs> Best big guy in the game. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Evening, Jim. Oh, sorry, I was yawning. Thank you very much, Martin Crew. Staying fantastic for 22 glorious months. Five and a half beaver pregnancies. Nearly two years. Thank you very much. Now a proper streamer for the first time in eight years. Enjoy. Enjoy subscribing to a real streamer. Thank you very much. <laughs> it's taken me long enough, but finally. So he, I'm surprised he valued the extra hit here. I thought he'd have got another player, like, you know, downfield. But... And doesn't even trap him between the two. Interesting. Interesting. I don't think he here. I would like, you know, move down the pitch and dodge this guy off or blitz this guy off to get him down. So. I would have definitely, if I was, if I'd have made this hit, I would have pushed him in here. To make his dodge away harder. Next turn is going to be horrible, isn't it? Ferrati. Honestly, maybe the best idea is to put the zombie in there and then dodge bits with this guy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I know this is like the safer way, right? This is the safer way of doing it. Sure. Sure, this is the safer way of doing it. It's not even really safer, is it? But it's more... Um, it feels safer, but maybe the best way was to uh, was to come in there and blitz him, so you'd have a little bit more down the field with everything else. Good protecting of the mummies for art. Might be blitzing the zombie to uh, get the rogue in. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll like do it with the guard. Yeah, do it with the guard. Two and one. Hey, Kaz, well done, Rogue. Best big guy in the game. He does do the chain. I thought he'd do the chain. Hello. Hello. Oh, who's this sexy voice individual? How are you? Uh, I'm wonderful, thanks. How are you? There's a roger on the ball, Jim. There is, yes. He just he's KO'd he's KO'd a guard of this drive, which he appled, and then he's just killed a uh, line rat. Oh, a line rat. Yeah. Oh, what, the roger. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but he has got tail on the ball, so he might he yeah. might yet win the drive. Funnily it's enough, it's quite funny how you got Olivier and Capo both like hating on their guard players, right? <laughs> yeah. Just, uh, yeah, it must be like a high level play to uh, keep smashing your uh, your guard guy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this looks actually pretty. Yeah, the mummy is still free though. One, two, three. It's a GFI. Yeah, he can't get there, can he? Well, he can... 
you can, if, well, you can just punch the guard geezer with the other mummy, and yeah, that's a good square. I was going to say because then he can just come in and blitz with the other mummy that yeah. way without doing the geofire. But yeah. Oh, but yeah. he doesn't get the pow. He doesn't get the pow. Oh, he's streaming it. Good. Yeah. Thank you, Jim Miffy. You're welcome, Dimothy. What was uh, the misclick? I missed the misclick. I, I heard you all chatting about it in chat, but I didn't see what the misclick was. Olivia blitzed with his roger, rolled the both down, and then didn't use Juggernaut, which was uh -huh. which was surely a misclick because it was a surf, right? It wasn't as if it was like in Where the middle of the field. It was it was it's like it was a surf, so like it had to be a misclick or you know a bug. Do you remember? Do you direction. remember Juggernaut on Blood Bowl two? Yes. Where you had to say no to it for it to work. Yes. Like, that was hilarious, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So it's probably something like that, yeah. So here we go, yeah, GFI. Like, what, I don't... I, it's, it's not the same one now, is it? It gets a power and it's with Mighty Blow and it's going to kill him. No apo. Dead, dead, dead. Not dead. Although, stalling out looks kind of difficult. It does. Doesn't it, Jim? Doesn't it, Jim? It does, it does, but it's against... It's against rats you can't give them a two turn you just you just can't you've got a zombie dodge instead oh, <laughs> yeah. the stripper? Is the... oh he's right oh no, that's the wrestle one the stripper the sh where it's not dead look at that where? oh he's the behind the roger here. yeah he's next to the roger the stripper is here right next to the ball but it's not easy to get in is it unless this is a dub skull in fact he can't even hit can he he ain't got no rerolls does he jim he hasn't got no rerolls, no. Got no rerolls, Jim. And he's got size that this good, so surely you can't even hit this guy. <clears throat> surely. Surely you can't be serious. Surely. I mean, if he doesn't hit him, it's just an uphill and then a two plus for a uphill with strip, right? Mm. Maybe Art is thinking about scoring, seeing as he thinks Olivia will score. Yeah. Oh, he just steps back. Yeah, that makes the uphill harder for the yeah. the bull sack. But this is just a three three. Oh no, it's a three four. Three oh. four in the side for uphill. Oh, we've got this one with a Russell, haven't we? We've got the Russell. Yeah, I think I prefer the stripper though. To be honest. Yeah, I mean the, the the stripper's got a bit further to go, hasn't he? He's got like two plus. I mean, yeah, this is this is four in for an uphill. Two three four for the. Stripper. But then, yeah, but then it's a better direction, and then you got the recovery on the side stepper, no? Yeah, yeah, it is pretty good. You might go for that. It's three, four uphill. Yeah, I don't know why he's doing that. Yeah, I guess he's safe. scoring for it. Oh god, okay, he's doing this one first. Oh, he's doing. Oh, he's getting oh, the full power. power. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is actually pretty great because now there's no dodges. Well, it's a dodge off the mummy, and it's just uphill. And then now you're pushing it into the wrestle as well, isn't it? Yep. So if it scatters out backwards, oh man, could he could could he have put the thrower as a scoring for it? He's got the body strip. Oh my god, this is hilarious. Oh my god. Hang on, where's is there someone based on the thrower? Surely he puts the thrower into scoring range. Yeah, you'd have thought so, wouldn't you? Come on, Olivier. But you... he might want to defend, right? Right at the moment, it's a bit of a yeah. threat, isn't it? So I'll see what happens and then. Well, mate, he needs to score in for it, because otherwise Art just gets the free roll of scoring. Like, that thrower, for me, personally, should have been in scoring range already. Mm -hmm. And I wouldn't even bother picking the Roger up, because he's just going to die. Because if Art <laughs> scores next turn, like, he's your one-turner. So put the thrower in range, man, and pick up the ball, <laughs> and then just lob it, lob it down the pitch. Inaccurate. He might, he might just hand off, though, right? He might just go for a hand off. One, two, three, what is it? four, it's five, six, seven, eight, hand off. Four plus... Five, the pickup's the dodgy one. Four yeah. plus, five plus, and then it's a four plus. Four, five, four, two. two plus. Yeah, four. this is not happening, is it, Jim? He's got Jim? all it's three rerolls. He's got all three rerolls, though. I think he probably got It's the it. five. It's the five. Okay, oh, he's put the right... Ah, oh, disappointing. I guess keeping him safe is also yeah. part of the job. Uh, and just loads of tackles almost to stop our score. Yeah, this is pretty good, isn't it? It's now he's got you strength think? three tackles. Yeah, he's got strength three tackle zones. Art's got no rerolls. This is not an easy solve, is it? Uh, I think you step the wrestler in and then you hit with the zombie into the stripper. 
and then that gives you the chain into the wrap below which removes one tackle zone. Oh, he's done it that way. Yeah. Don't know about that. No, this is fine, right? Because then if he powers, he powers, but this, now he gets to hit with a school anyway, right? To do the same, the same kind of thing. Yeah, but he's got no assist on the leader. He gets a 3D here. You can always hit the other one first as well, right? Because he's got guard. And he's got, like, he's got oh, so he... Oh, no, 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 because now he has oh, to dodge the wrestle to bits. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is... Oh, he's got the mummy, so the mummy can tag the mighty blow and then the guarder can hit and follow and then he can just blitz, pick it up and dodge through. Okay, he's dodged with him. Yeah, I think this is... I think this is crazy, like, I think this was way easier. I would have Seems stepped the mummy... Right, it? Yeah, I would have stepped that mummy down onto the mighty blow, hit the, with the guard and then followed. The guard instantly pushes him off the ball. Yeah. <clears throat> and then just picked it up and run through the gap, right? Mm -hmm. It just seems like he's... Now he's got to dodge the ball carrier, which he wouldn't have had to do. Yep. I guess this way... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I think that was way easier than it. he made it look. But he wanted to hit He wanted to hit the rogue, didn't he? That's the thing. He wants to hit the rogue. Ah, uh, is that what it... Yeah. For match equity, turner. which is fair enough. Yeah, try and... Try and stop yeah. Turn. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we'll let him off. Yeah, punching the rogue is pretty good. It's a one in nine with no reroll though. Well, he's not, not punching the rogue. And he fails the pick up. Oh, has he? Oh my god, he's got wet! This is. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. Uh, it's still really awkward. He has to Double just 4 3. Yeah, 4 3. Just don't even block him. Just dodge. Nah, he's got to be able to do something better than that, surely. Like this. this well, he can't blitz. blitz. Oh right, but then that's a, that's a three plus, yeah. and then but three two is better than a four, isn't it? Mm, yeah, he's got the re rolls. I guess he's got the re rolls. Plus he's got and a then bit he, that could run all the way around. But he's a he's a three two better than making a four a three, if that makes sense. Oh, because then you got the four three instead of just the three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Alright, so fails it. More rolls is better when you've got re rolls, basically. Yeah, more lower rolls is better than one yeah. higher roll. Yeah, not just more not just more rolls. <laughs> <laughs> I've got more re rolls, that's wrong. Oh he's made the dodge. Yeah. So gets, gets the pow. Down, yeah. Gets to kill something on the way. And here we go. Three two two three two. With two re rolls, very likely. He's made the dodge. He's made the hard part. Oh no, the handoff's the hard part, I guess. Oh, there he's made it. Easy. Just the Six, time. five. So, oh, wow. he's conceded. Wow. 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 That's, uh, That's not what I would have done. It was not yeah. GG at that point, was it? That was... That well, it is was, now. Yeah, it is now. <laughs> that was definitely, definitely not GG. Um, yeah. 2 nil. Wow. Well, yeah. Um, Art could have definitely battled back into that, right? We've seen, we've seen Scave and fail offences before, right? Either they've failed dice rolls or... You know, like if they track and quick score, he could have failed like a two plus with a reroll. It cause it was a rage quit. Of course it was, but uh, shouldn't have been. Shouldn't have been. He's still, it's still like you know. Of course he's very low percent, but he's not zero percent at that point, is he? It's not like all of the other concedes we've had was when the game was lost, and that's the first concede we've had in Super League when the game wasn't over. It was, you know, he was low up. It was, yeah, it's looking really shit from there, to be honest. Yeah. I mean, all Olivier has to do is bang it in in two, and then... Yeah, but it, so he, to do that, he's going to have to roll dice, right? He's going to have to roll one in 36s. So he's at least 3%. Like, you know, it's, <clears> it's, it's not over. It's not over. It's not over. It's not over. But, um, yeah, he'd had his tackler killed, which probably tilted him a bit didn't it and then he failed his 50-50 pick up into getting scored on with a perfect scatter of course he catches it two tackles oh no it weren't it weren't a 50-50 oh of course it was yeah sorry yeah. excuse me 
Because yeah. he didn't have a reroll, did he? Yeah. Um, no, this the is... The one-week ban. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, uh, this is Super League, so it's up to J5 to admonish uh, Art if, if, if anything happens. But otherwise, it's just a, a concede for Art and a win for Olivia. So there you go. Yeah, I don't think it's... Like, I mean, it's, it's pretty much... Like, like, I get it. I get it. Yeah. Like, it's, it's understandable. I get it, but I mean, it was also it was a lot less over than uh, other games. Yeah, it's definitely it's like you can definitely try and grind out for a draw or something, or like yeah. even a win. I yeah, know. yeah. Art could art is definitely drawn from that position before. Yeah, undead, definitely. undead. Like you can just randomly kill for shit, can't you? Yeah. Just... yeah, yeah. But anyway, it is what it is. Um. Congratulations to Olivia, commiserations to Art. Thanks for watching, everybody. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Oh, thanks, Dimmy, as well. Oh, no, I just jumped in, mate, because I just finished work. I was just, uh, no, it's still it's nice quite to hear excited to watch. Yeah. It's all over now. It's, it's all, all over. over. It's all over. It's all over. And stay fantastic.